Hello and welcome to Marketing in the Matrix. My name is Joe Kingsley. I'm a senior account manager here. And today we're going to talk about how to properly set up Google Authorship for your website. Today we're going to talk about how to set up Google Authorship. Now if you don't know what Google Authorship is, if you do a Google search and you notice those faces in the search results, that's Google Authorship. It stands out among the rest and it also gives your website a lot of recognition. So it's very important. And how to get started? First things first, you go to Google and you create an account. This account will cover a lot, but most importantly, just create a Google account and then create a Google Plus account. From there, of course, the only thing left is a website. So if you have those three, a Google account, a Google Plus account, and a website, that's all you need to start with Google Authorship. The first thing you want to do when you set up a Google Plus profile is add a nice high quality picture. That's what's going to be linked with all the authorship posts. So that's important. So it's going to show up on all the Google searches once you start ranking. And then after that, you want to go to About, scroll to Links, and then click Edit. From there, you want to go to the Contributor section. And then once you're at the Contributor section, make sure the label is the business name and the URL is the website address. And then you hit Save. That's step one. Now, to finish this, you're going to have to edit your website. So go into the content section and add a buy link that reads by your name or for example, by Joe Kingsley. After that's done, you want to create a text link and have that go to your Google Plus profile. So the text link would be for Joe Kingsley or again, whatever the name is that you're focusing on for that authorship. After that's done, you want to actually create a link and make sure it's included in there as well for REL equals author. Once that's done, you can run a test using the Google Authorship testing tool. And then from there, it'll give you a message if it's done correctly that says Authorship is working for this web page. So that's it. Two easy steps to setting up Google Authorship. And if you have any questions at all, please, by all means, reach out to us. 1-800-IMATRIX. Support team here five days a week. We're more than ready to help you out. Thank you.